in five children with no health insurance in the United States live in Texas. That's according to a new study, claiming the Lone Star State has the highest uninsured rate in the country. Our Marlene Rodriguez has all the details. Everything is bigger in Texas, including the number of uninsured kids. A Georgetown University Center for Children and Families report found that the state's rate of uninsured children in 2017 was at a 10.7 percent, increasing from the year before and more than double the national average, making the highest uninsured rate of any state in the U.S. And one local organization is partnering up with a hospital to provide affordable health care. We know that um, in the RGB we have a high number of uninsured people, uh, from children to adults. This is the second year in a row that Texas has had the highest number of uninsured children in the country. Luckily, clinics like this allow children and their families to get the health care they need. We uh, go out into the colonias or any other parts of the RGV um, just to facilitate the access to health care. In 2017, there were about 835,000 uninsured children in the state, a number that increased from the previous year. Researchers believe this could be because of the state and federal government's anti-affordable care act talk and tough rhetoric around immigration that discourages families from seeking coverage. La Union del Pueblo Intero hopes the doctor's hospital at Renaissance Mobile Health Clinic will help keep the community healthy. Everyone. Um deserves, uh, you know, the quality of health care to have access to, to health care, regardless if they have insurance or not. In San Juan, Marlene Rodriguez, Local 23 News. The doctor's hospital at Renaissance Mobile Health Clinic will be at the Lupe office on Alton, December 12th from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m.